What's up, Air Gunners? I'm Tyler Patner, and today I'm gonna give you my top three youth air guns. Now, getting an air gun for a kid's kind of tough these days. There's not a whole lot of options, but there are some real classics and good choices for those with uh, smaller frames, smaller hands. So let's start right off at the Crossman 760. Now, multi-pump gun, you're gonna wanna pump it at least three times, which should be very manageable for a kid. Um, but you have a bolt action system and it can shoot BBs or pellets. You've got sights built in, you could throw a scope on it if you want to. Bunch of different packages, we've got different color combos that this thing comes in, but it is a great youth rifle. It's been around for over 50 years, uh, long history of, uh, a, well, a lot of people have shot this gun, let's just leave it at that. And even more popular is our second pick here, and that is the Daisy Red Rider. Now everybody knows Ralphie almost shot his eye out, blah, 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 that whole thing. Uh, but the Red Rider is actually a really awesome BB rifle. It's a ton of fun to use, and they're relatively accurate. Again, at short distances with these open sights, you're gonna do just fine. You can even throw a scope on it with our lasso scope mount, which is definitely something you should check out, especially for those of you trying to teach a uh, younger shooter how to maybe look through an optic as well. Real handy to have. Last but certainly not least, may surprise some of you, but it's one of my favorites, and that is the Colt Single Action Army Peacemaker. Now, the reason I like this gun in particular for youth shooters is because it has a thinner grip, it's easier to get your hand around, and off a bag, you still have to manipulate it by cocking the hammer each time. So it's not kind of that instant gratification semi-auto that most pistols are. So you have to be more deliberate in how you use that gun, which is one of the things I like about it for kids that maybe have shorter attention spans, they get that quick follow-up shot that's relatively easy and in a small format, and gets them familiar with pistols at a young age. Now, these are my top three picks for youth guns. You guys let us know down in the comments what you think or what maybe you started with if it's not one of these three or what you're planning to start your kids with uh, here in the near future. Thanks for watching and we'll see you at the next one.